How's it going guys? So this is the result from UFC 224. Okay, so since you are still here, I'm assuming that you would like to know what happened. And before I go on, I would like to say that I am just going to announce the the main card only. Here we go. To kick off to kick off the main card, we have Leoto Mishida defeating Vito Belfort second round KO. 60 second one minute into the second round holy smoke you guys if you have missed out you have missed out because i realized that v2 belfort he has not looked as good as he used to but at the, at the end of the day he is still a legend and honestly i don't think this is going to be his last fight this was this is was his last fight without the ufc but Vito Belfort, he's still a name. He he is still an attraction. I honestly believe that he will not sign with uh, with UFC. But however, Bellator is around the corner. I can see him coming back and competing with Bellator. If this is the last time that we see Vito Belfort in uh, in, the, in the UFC, I don't know what to say, man. It's it is what it is. It's unfortunate that he lost the way he did. So yeah, to kick off the main card, Leon Mishida defeating Vito Belfort. And next we have John Lineker defeating Brian Kisseler. Third round, 3 minutes, 43 seconds into the third round with the KO. You know what, I don't know what to say about this one. It is what it is. Going on to this fight, I was picking um, John, John, John Lineker to win. Yeah, it's... I honestly believe that John Linker, John Lineker is a level ahead of Brian. Of <laughs> I believe John Lineker is a level ahead of Brian. So, yeah, it is what it is. I'm not surprised. Next we have Mackenzie, Mackenzie Dern defeating Amanda Cooper. You guys, <laughs> Mackenzie Dern missed seven pounds. Okay, she beat um, Mackenzie Dern defeating Amanda Cooper. Rear naked choke. 2 minutes 27 seconds into the first round. <laughs> you know what? I don't know what to say. I'm I should I should be impressed, but I am not. She missed weight. This was supposed to be a, a 115 pound match. McKen McKenzie came in at 123. Missing weight by 7 pounds. I realized that You know what? I take everything back. I was gonna say that I realized that cutting weight is a big issue, but come on, man, you are a professional. Like this is this is ridiculous. We got a flyweight fighting against, well, Amanda Cooper against a straw weight. She just she was just too big and too strong. I was hoping, you know, I guess I'm not gonna lie. I was rooting for Amanda Cooper to win, but it didn't go that way. So Mackenzie Dern defeating Amanda Cooper. 2 minutes, 27 seconds into the first round with the rear naked choke. And next we move on to the co-main event. We have Kelvin Gaslam defeating Jack Ray Sosa. Split decision. Wow. If you guys missed this card, if you guys missed this fight, not just to cover this fight, this in my opinion is the fight tonight. Going on to this fight, I was picking Jack Ray to, to defeat Kevin Gaslam. And I honestly believe, and I still do, 1%. That the winner of this fight should be the next in line for the UFC middleweight title. And Kevin won, he's next. That's what it is, you guys. Kevin won, he's next. Jack Ray, man, he is he is an old guard. This to me was a, was an exciting fight. They popped each other back and forth. Each um, each fighter took a lot of big hits. It's a great fight. It's a great fight. I really enjoyed this fight. My pick for fighter tonight. And on to the main event, we have Amanda Nunes taking on Raquel Paddington. Amanda Nunes defeating Raquel, 2 minutes 36 seconds into the 5th round with a TKO. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna lie, I was picking Raquel to win. I realized that uh, according to a lot of the odds maker, she was as, as high or as low, as high as um, negative 1000. So yeah. Amanda was Amanda Amanda Nunes was a massive favorite, but 
I like the I like I like to root for the underdog. I cannot say that I was surprised, but I was hoping it um, Raquel would have won. But regardless, I might have won. It's not what I want, but this is the reality. Amanda Nunes defeating Raquel Pennington, two minutes thirty six second into round five. Okay, guys. So thank you very much for listening. If, if you have not, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and tell me what you think in the comment section below. Take care, and I will talk to you soon.